Hello everyone, this is GamerCat09 and welcome back to One Shot as uh, Nico was calling us out. Cat? Oh, I gotta hang on. And then. There we go. And then move that. Cat? Are you still there? I'm here. It happened again. Everything just went really dark. So dark, the light bulb doesn't even light it. Yes. So. Are you here for your photos? Actually, yeah. I need to take a picture for raisins. Well, I got good news and bad news. The good news is, is that the photo center is right behind me. The bad news is that it doesn't work, right? Hey, you're catching on quick. After operations ended in the Barrens, this place got shut down. All of the engineers lost their jobs and became street vendors. Maybe Kat and I can figure it out from, from them. That's good. It would certainly help out people with expired IDs, like me. Okay, so they became street vendors. So let's talk to people. Is there anything you remember about how to work the camera? Let me see. When arranging the lenses, make sure that the thin lens is positioned between the two curved ones. So the thin one between the two curved ones. Can someone type that out in chat? Thin between the two curved? Can you tell me how to get the camera working again? Yes, yes, certainly. The thick lens should be positioned to the left of both the curved lenses. Okay, so that's another one, Foxy. Thick lens to the left of the curved lenses. Thick to left of curves. Great, thank you. Uh, was there another one? What about this guy? He looks busy. You can tell, huh? Okay, so, no. Can't do that one. This guy. Used to be one of the camera engineers, right? The camera? Oh, joyous memories. We went through thick and thin together. And by that, I mean the concave lens did. Wait, what? We went through... Thick and thin together. And by that, I mean the concave lens did. Oh, between thick and thin. So the concave was between thick and thin. I know, it is a horrible joke, but the concave between thick and thin. That's the next one I need. Okay. Thank you. Can you tell me how to fix the camera? Hmm, it's been a while. I'm pretty sure that the bulgy lens goes on one of the ends, but I forget which. So, bulgy lens on end? Yeah. Okay, so let's try to figure it out. I think that's pretty much it. Okay. So. Um... The bulgy lens. Alright. So, we have the thin one between the curves. The thick to the left of the curves. Concave between thick and thin. So, this one's got to be between thick and thin. And the bulgy one. So I guess the bulgy one is the convex. I guess. So let's try it. So let's try that. And then... So thin between curves, thick left of curves, concave between thick and thin. So maybe the thin one? Hmm. Hmm. 
So let's do the thin lens here. And then concave is between thick and thin. And then this one. No, that did not work. The thin needs to be between the two curves. Okay. So, let's put these back for a second. Okay. Maybe take that one and do that. But the concave needs to be between the thick and thin. Thin between curves. Thick to left of curves. Maybe this one goes over here. Concave one is between the thick and thin. It's the convex. That's the concave. It's between the thick and thin. Maybe that? Nope. So it's not this one either. Maybe that? Oh, that'll work, right? Yes! Huzzah! Uh, cheese? Nice. Ouch! M my eyes! Aw, oh, sweet. It's a photo of me! Are my eyes always this big? There's a slot here. Looks like paper or something might come out from it. Yeah, we just got a picture. Cat and I fixed the camera! Aw, oh, sweet! Okay. So now I need to combine this with this the back of the photo is covered in glue and glitter and then we're going to put that on top of the card the card has my face on it now yay so now i can go back to the library so oops wait equip that and then go to the library i did it <laughs> I was like, I'm almost there. I know I'm almost there. Alright, let's see if we can get past the security robot thing. Unauthorized entry. Library card required for further access. I know, I know. Authenticating barcode. Executing facial recognition. Photo match successful. You're good to go. Have a nice day, Miss Kip. Maybe I should have changed the name. Hooray! What's up here? A plant. Small tree. Big windows. Another small tree. There's garbage in here. Some sort of... Some of the trash spilled out on the floor. It's full. Looks like an old phone. Ooh. Oh, hello there! You must be the savior! And also the cutest darn thing I've ever seen! Uh, um, thank you? Can I help you with anything, sweetie? Mm-hmm. I want to know what I should do next. I think I'm supposed to go in the tower? 
Oh, that's right, the tower. I know there's a small room that you could go into, but I'm afraid nobody knows how to get in beyond that. Not even silly old me who spent her entire life reading books about the world. Ah. I think you need some help from Cat, but I don't know any details. I never found any books about this before. You'd think there would be at least one book on this, but I guess that's just how it is. Goodness, this is quite the dilemma. Is that is that a hint we gotta find a book? These boxes are full of loose papers and notebooks. I see you've taken it oh. I see you've taken an interest in the manuscripts. What are they for? Well, aren't you curious, little one? The author passed these drafts to me, you see. Since I'm the head librarian, I'm supposed to help him publish these. But, oh, I haven't seen that gentleman lately. Which is quite strange. Usually he delivers these manuscripts to me faster than I can work on them. I guess now it just means I get a little more breathing room. Ho ho ho! That's good, right? I don't know, I am quite worried about him. I hope he hasn't fallen ill from all that stress. At least I got my hands full for the time being. Even though he stopped sending me things, it doesn't feel like he did it all. The pile of manuscripts I still need to proofread doesn't seem to get smaller. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. It's a black cover symbol on the cover of this book. Hey, this other book has a clover on its spine. And the rest of these books, too. Are they all about clovers? Of course not, dear. The black clover is sort of the author's name, you see. Oh? Actually, we don't know his name. He just uses a clover to mark his works is all. So, he wrote all of these books? He's a trooper, that. Maybe she can read our book. This is, this is the box I'll get to publish this week. Oh, did I mention this gentleman's books are quite popular? You might be a little too young to understand them, but the older kids love them. Oh? What does he write about? Lots and lots of things. Everything from plants and animals to machines and robots. Some of his books even have pictures. Yeah, we know that. Um, what's this? A book is poking out from the shelf. My eyes! Ooh. Another fruitful dis visit to the great prophet today. She seemed high in spirits. She told me that she saw another glimpse of the Messiah's arrival, more vivid than ever before. The Messiah will wake up in a dark house. She said the vision included lights from a window and the sound of footsteps on wood floor. Regre regrettably, she is unsure of the house's location. Rachel was also present at the meeting. I ended up visiting this house, his house later, and we swapped notes. He has been very vigilant on recording the Prophet's Day, today musings, and his writing has been significantly more legible lately. His children were endearing as ever. The older child, Calamus, has expressed an interest in reading. I offered to teach him as I did his father. Okay. This looks like a sketchbook of some sort. Oh, look at that! 9, 10, 45, 22. I don't understand the date, but Wednesday. Another still life of some objects on my desk. Still not very good, but Silver can recognize the objects at least. 9, 10, 45, 23. Thursday, various sketches practice. Interesting. A book is poking out. Hey, I think this book is actually about clovers. Although its pigmentation is primarily black, the leaves display incredible iridescence when exposed to sunlight. These curious plants are most resilient and can even thrive in the metallic sand and harsh climate of the barrens. In the glen, it can also grow directly on top of the moss layer without competing with the moss for resources. Radiocarbon radiocarbon dating of fossils suggests that these plants may be the first life forms to colonize our world. Interesting. Can I help you with anything else, dear? If you have any questions about books, well, I am a librarian. Well, I do, but not right now. I want to read about stuff. The fridge is full of bottled water and takeout boxes. I hope that nice gentleman is all right. If I knew where he lived, I would have sent him some soup or a nice blanket. Is that all she's going to say every time I look in these boxes? I guess. I keep a copy of every single book I helped him publish. Feel free to read anything you'd like, dear. There's a couple of picture books that you might be interested in. Oh. Okay. So... Looks like a printer.
can't go back there. Computer screen says something about updated databases. A small bed. I guess she lives here. Okay. There's some stuff upstairs. We can go check out. Uh, thankfully, Dr. Silverpoint's team was able to replicate our prototype. On the right is an updated sketch of some of the modifications of the external design. More importantly, we used a radically different architecture for the micropressor due to limited resources this time, but it still should be capable of delivering the late profits message. The team suggested that taming was a lost cause. Oh, that's the, um, the, the profit bot. Was that what he was called? I forget. Blue phosphor, rounder look, redesigned internal audio receptor, compatible with longer clothing, wireless signal amplifier. Interesting. It's a bookshelf. Box full of notebooks. Okay, so let's get this book out and see if she can read it. Oh, I do have this book. I think it's written in some sort of words I don't recognize. Really now, may I take a closer look, dear? Here. Oh, oh my, where did you find this? Somewhere in the barrens. Oh, we found it in a safe. Right, Cat? Hmm, I think I'm supposed to translate this for you. Is it all right if I hold on to the journal for now, sweetheart? It might take a little while, I'm afraid. Go for it. Oh, excuse me. Oh, you poor baby. Goodness, you must have worked so hard to help us. I think you deserve a nap, no? A nap does sound nice. I have a guest room upstairs. It's just down the hall to the right. Nice. Gonna go take a nap. Gonna go take a nap. Yes, profit bot, thank you. Aw, yeah. It's a stack of blank papers. I, I almost read that it's a stack of paper blankets. That's what I wanted to read because I saw the bed, but you know. Box full of manuscripts. Stack of blank papers. A book on the ground. But she deeply believed in the multiverse theory. Regarding alternate versions, she likened the probability to the rolling of dice. Recently, I found that theory easier and easier to believe, but I could not describe it very well back then. Nevertheless, I still wrote it to the best of my abilities. After all, it felt only right to honor her this way. There are six. Which one did you encounter? Hmm. Interesting. I got bookworm achievement because I read all the books. All right. I'm a little tired from walking. Is it all right if I take a nap? Yes. And then the game closes. Maybe. Perhaps. I believe so! Okay. So. Yep, Roo. Unless it just reloads. I forget. Does it reload? Game over, good game. <laughs> right? It's just like... Listen! Listen! Nico is sleeping. <laughs> Don't make fun of her or him. I haven't determined what that is, but... Okay. Time to... Play it again! Ah, go way of asked. Look at her! She's so cute! The little kicky feet, and she's eating the foods. What's that? Oh no. Uh oh. <gasps> no! Not the light! Oh no! That was a nightmare. Hey, cat? I guess you saw my dream? Yes. It was... 
Come on, let's go. In denial about it, that's always a great sign. Did you even translate my book? Had a good nap, dear. Mm-hmm. Wonderful. I have the translation ready for you now. It looks like this journal might be meant for Cat. Hmm. Also, her face is five. Oh? Here, why don't you take a look? Greetings, Cat. If you can finally read this, that means you are near the tower. The tower is the domain of an elusive entity. This being is connected to the world. For now, you can think of it as the spirit of the world. It has no physical form, but it can communicate through computers and other machinery. You know who I am talking about, of course. When you first arrived here with our savior, it is it no doubt contacted you right away. Through its own means, the entity will guide the both of you to the tower. The entry room is at the tower's base. Not only do you need the sun there, but also three pieces of the previous sun. The savior will not be able to do anything there. You, cat, on the other hand. Whoa, I saw you, Bavast. Look at the pattern on the floor. Do as it says. The window will be gone, so you will need to bring it back. So, follow the floor pattern, and the I gotta bring the window back. That is all there is to translate. It looks like the other pages have been torn out. Oh. Quite a shame. I was wondering what window was supposed to mean. Ah, well, I guess Cat can figure that one out. Right. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, what does it mean by three pieces of the previous sun? I only have this sun. That means the stuff containing yellow phosphor. They glow for a very long time, so people call them pieces of the sun sometimes. Oh. I do have a piece of amber and a feather. They're both glowing yellow. Very good, dear. And I can help you with the last one. Oh, the dice? There's glowing dice? Oh. It looks like you. I know, isn't it silly? But now you'll have something to remind you of the library. Ah, oh, thank you. Good luck now, sweetie. I wish you safe travels. Thanks, library lady. You're so nice. Okay, so now I gotta go. I have... <laughs> it's just like, feather amber, die! <laughs> like, my god. Because it's only one. Okay. So. Time to leave. If you have an inquiry, please approach me from the front. I'm good, thanks. So now I guess I gotta go directly to the tower? Seems like the most logical thing. Hey, cat. Do you remember where the cafe is? Ah. Uh... Yes? Oh, good. I'm asking because, well, I'm a little hungry. Actually, I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten anything since I got here. So, is it okay if we go get some food before we enter the tower? I hope they have pancakes. Okay. So, let's go to the back alley first. We must go say hi to the kitties. I, I don't know where the kitties are. Nope, not that way. Oh, there's a fox up here too, right? There's no one here. Foxy's not here. Foxy, why aren't you in my game anymore? Marking looks like a ram. Kitties! I 
like you. You've been here a while. Are you sure you do not wish to stay? I'm good, thanks for offering, though. I gotta save the world for the kitties. I, I like you. Please, please keep the kitties warm. Mr. Furnace Man. Let's go to the Vendor Street. Okay. Smells kind of nice. What is it? Breaded fish. Toast the bread myself. I see. Where was the cafe? Want some soup dumplings? But you're hungry! I don't understand where this... Is that the factory? I don't remember there being... Or do I have to leave the area and go somewhere else? Or no, that's back- Okay, wait, 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 wait. I know where I'm going. Crap. Um. I know where I'm going. I have to go... Elevator Street. I gotta go to the elevator. And I gotta go up to the cafe. That's where I'm going. I had to think. I was like, wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um... I believe it was this way? It's either this one or the top right one. I don't remember which. This one. Oh, hey, you're back! Did you manage to fix the elevator? Mm-hmm. Cat and I went to the surface already, and... Well, I remember there being a cafe here. Do you have pancakes? We sure do. Wait, I don't have any money. Maybe I can help wash dishes or something? Oh no, it's on the house. The least I could do for the savior, right? Here, why don't you take a seat? I'll go fry some up for you. Pancakes. Aw. Look at me with my little pancakes! Oh no, that's a bad place to put the light bulb. You don't put that there. These pancakes are so good. Thank you so much. No problem. You looked really hungry. Yeah, I thought this would be my last chance to eat something before I go in the tower. Ah, gotcha. So, I guess pancakes are your favorite food? Mm-hmm. Well, almost. My favorite food in the world are the special pancakes that my mama makes. She likes to pick hazelnuts and grind them up into the batter. Oh, wow. That sounds amazing. That actually really does. They taste amazing. She always made them when I was feeling sad, or lonely, or... Mama. I really miss her. I just... I just have bad feeling all of a sudden. Am I even here to save the world? People have been saying how the sun won't fix anything. I don't even know why I'm here. I just want to see my mama again. Oh, uh... There, there. It's gonna be okay. And I'm sure you'll be able to save the world. You're a tough kid. You managed to get this far already, right? Yeah, but... And you'll get to go home afterwards, right? Right. Hey, want some more pancakes? It's okay. I'll be fine. Poor Nico. So, yeah. Thanks for coming by. 
Mm-hmm. Thanks for listening. And for the pancakes. No problem. Good luck. All right. Well, that, that was nice that we actually got to use this cafe. So now can go to the tower. Poor little Nico. It's appropriate reaction. You're a little kid and you're you're trying to save the world. It sucks. Mm-hmm. How to... Oh, what did this guy ever do? You alright? Ah, the Messiah. Perhaps this is a sign. Tell me, do you think you can fix the world with the sun? Honestly, I don't know. I'm getting mixed messages. I know. But what do you think? I think... I think I should listen to Cat. After all, she... Cat helped me get this far. I will take your faith for an answer, then. What do you mean by that? It means whatever you think it means. Okay, so... I gotta find my way back to the tower. I got there by accident once. So let's get there again. That is so weird. So the X. <laughs> um. No, that doesn't do anything. Weird. I feel like I should close the game, but I don't think that's what it wants me to do. But, like, that's the only logical thing I think of doing, because there's just an X, and then there's an X here. So it makes me want to click that. Well, damn. I just closed the game. Shit. Maybe that's what I was supposed to do? Oh, I don't know. Oh. Not sure what happened. Is this the inside of the tower? It's a lot darker than I thought. Wait, where's the sun? Cat, do you know what happened to the sun? Cat? Oh no. Cat? Come on, cat. Say something. Cat! What's going on? Uh oh. Oh no. Oh. Ooh! Hello, Nico. H Hello. Congratulations, you are now inside the tower. Are you talking to me now? Correct. But you were always talking to Cat before. Where's... Cat has already left. I'm right here! I'm literally right here! I'm literally right here. I had to resort to contacting you directly. Wait, so Cat is gone? Just like that? Correct. For good? No! No! No, I'm not gone! Correct. Cat has already finished their mission. 
And so have you, Nico. Here, you can rest now. Everything that's happened here is like a bad dream. When you wake up, you will be home. Oh! But... What's wrong? I thought there'd be more to it, you know? I thought we were supposed to go to the top of the tower. I thought there was supposed to be somewhere we need to put the sun in. And now, I don't even have the sun anymore. And Ken is just... Gone! I'm not gone! I'm here! This feels wrong. Because it is! But you did good. You saved the world, Nico. Are you not happy? I guess I am. But it's just... Wow, rude. Hung up on me. I feel like I should not... I feel like that's a trap. I don't know if I want to do that. I do like running around though. I'm going Oh, there's there's literally nothing else. It just circles back around. All right. I never even got to say goodbye to Cat. How could you just go to sleep? And as for you, Cat, we're done here. Please don't return to this world anymore. Oh, hell no. The game just did not know. F you, game. Going back for Nico. Uh-oh. This is not over. Regardless of what the entity told you, there is more to the story. Documents my game's one shot. Look for this symbol. Once it is active, please relaunch the game. Oh, okay. So. Actually, I need to... What is it? Documents my games. One shot. So. Browse local files. Oh, there it is. So wait, what did it say? Once it is active, relaunch the game. Okay, wait. Let me... Oh. I'm... Stuck? Wait. I can't close the game. Oh, there we go. Okay. So, I have to launch this and make this active. And then go back and relaunch the game. There we go. Nico! She's like, what? <laughs> I'm right here! Hello? Cat? Was that you just now? I thought I heard your voice in my dream. Uh, I guess you're still not there. I'm right here! Wait, there's something in my pocket. I don't remember putting it there. A clover! I have a clover. You're still here. Nico, why are you still here? Whoa! Oh! <laughs> you! 
Why did you come back, Cat? I told you to stay away. You knew I tried to cut the story short, is that it? You want more out of me, is that it? Fine. If you want to leave, I'll make sure you never do. <gasps> oh no. Oh, oh, this is... What was it? F4? F5? F3? What? Which one? F something did it. Oh god, no. That wasn't it. Wait, what was... Maybe you'll tell me? Nope. It does not. Was it F4? It does not work. So maybe I'm just playing it like this now. Okay. Whoa! Back then I told you about the entity as little as possible. Oh wait, am I supposed to... Do this? So it's supposed to... Guide me? Oh, put the clover over it! Okay. He said, back then I told you about the entity as little as possible. That's cool. Where's the... Apologies for that. I did not want to put the librarian in danger. So I gotta go up now. This being has a habit of silencing the people who learn of its true nature. So I have to go up now. Regrettably, I have seen it happen to dear friends. Ah, but do not worry. The entity cannot touch you. So I gotta go back left? Nor can it do anything to me. Go down? Am I just going back the way I came? I already left the world on my own terms. So I gotta go down. I never meant for the entity to exist. But now that it is fully sentient, one thing became clear. Okay. The entity seeks death. So I gotta go to this one. Death to itself, death to the world, a relentless desire that manifested physically. So I go to this one. You already have seen the scars. Right now, the entity is doing everything it can to impede your progress, stalling for even a few minutes. Okay, so wait, which one was it? That one. Okay. I have to keep clicking the wit- Oh no! I went the wrong way! Oh, crap. Ah. So I gotta go that way. And 
and then this way. So sensitive. So, that one. Okay. You've already seen the scars, so it's the last one. And it's this one. So I gotta, I'm just gonna go all the way down. There we go. Whew. Before you inevitably bring the sun to the tower's summit. That is where you, God, will make the final judgment for the world. Just gonna go to the right one. Of course, the entity will contact you again there. So the middle one. And when it does, it will trick you into shattering the sun. So wait, which one? This one. This will end the world instantly. the far one. Okay. Why is it not talking anymore? It's gotta be that one. No, no, it is not that simple. Okay, so the second on the left here. I'm sorry, I do not know what to do in a situation like this. So that's the middle one. But I think I have to tell you the truth. The sun is the Messiah's tie to the world. How am I supposed to? I feel like there should be a way to It doesn't really work though. Okay. Like why I can't seem to move when I, yeah, I can't move if I have the other window selected. That's the problem. <laughs> That's why I was like, I feel like I should be able to do this without switching windows, but for some reason I, I can't seem to, and I don't know why. It's really weird. Just have to memorize it then? Oh god. Alright. Okay. And then it goes one, two, three, four in. And then down to that.
Oh no! I didn't do it right. It's gotta go over here. It's actually more. <laughs> okay, so... Okay. So let's go down here. Shattering the sun may terminate this world, but... So wait, the center of it? Yeah. So I gotta start from... Like, out here. And go in. I gotta go out. Yep, just what I thought. That's pretty cool. I like the music. Nice. Oh god. It is also the only way for the Messiah to return home. So... So wait. So three and then up one and then over one. One more. this and down to this and then one two one two crap now I gotta do the center I can do it from this side, it'll be easier. Like, start from there. Go up 
to here. go. Oh boy. Okay. Can I afford it now? It doesn't seem like I can yet. Hmm. Okay. Well, it's a tiny screen. I apologize. It's the light bulb. Thank goodness it's safe. I guess Cat isn't coming back. What if. Oh, Nico, I'm here! Cat? Yes? Is that really you? I thought you were gone. I never left you. Oh, I was feeling a bit scared back there. I thought I was completely alone. But that was silly of me to assume, wasn't it? Uh, I guess we need to figure out where to go now and... The sun! It lit up on its own! I guess I should pick it up, right, Cat? Look at that. Like, I want to F for it. Oh, it's F8. It's F8, not F4. F8. Okay. I was like, I'm just going to try all of them. Oh, am I back in the house? Yeah, I'm back in the house. What is neatly stacked in the fireplace? There's nothing in the fridge. It's a sink. TV works. So you actually made it here. I guess you win, Cat. I'll tell you how to save the world then. When you reach the summit, shatter the light bulb and... Yeah, go away. We know that's not right. Are all these locked? I'm just humoring you. I know you've been getting help from a certain someone. He already told you about the choice, didn't he? What is happening? Are you still planning to save the world, Cat? Why are you trying so hard for this? Haven't you even figured out what this world is? Stop. Let me play. I told you at the beginning, your mission is to help Nico leave. Because Nico isn't part of this world. Nico's the only thing worth saving here. The final choice is up to you. I can't go against my programming. God damn it. This is more annoying to shift the, the things. Ah, oh, you only have one shot, Cat! If you choose to smash the light bulb, then Nico wakes up back home like it was all a dream. If you let Nico return the sun, the child will have to bear the weight of this sacrifice. What? What are you talking about? At least tell Nico the truth. You do care about Nico, don't you? I don't trust you. At all. He's so chatty. Sure is taking a while. I guess this elevator leads to the top of the tower, cat. Oh, 
Are you excited, cat? No. We're finally gonna save the world! And I know it's for real this time, because you're here! And then... I'll get to go home for real this time, too. I can't wait to see everyone again. Are you okay, cat? You seem a little quiet. <sighs> Nico. Yeah? Do I believe what the computer is telling me, or do I... I don't believe... I don't believe Shatter it will send them home, but I guess I should tell them anyway. I need to tell you something. I'm listening. We can't save both. The world and you. What? What's that supposed to mean, cat? To send you home. Uh-oh. We must break the light bulb. What? But won't that... But won't that end the world? Yeah. I don't want that to happen. So what happens when we save the world? What happens to me? I don't know. You don't? Oh. This is so upsetting. So this is where the sun belongs. If I put the sun in here, we'll be able to save the world, right? But if I want to go home, I'll have to break it? Oh. Cat? What should I do? What's the right thing to do? Oh no! Oh. Oh my god! <sighs> so if I return the sun, I save everybody in this world. If I return home, the world ends. Everyone's dead. But that's just presumably, because maybe that person's also- the, the computer's also lying. So maybe it's kind of like a psych, you'll go home anyway thing, or whatever. I mean, we've made friends along the way. We met a demonic goat. <laughs> um, the world is full of robots. That is true. Maybe Nico will also die. <laughs> Hakaru, return son and go back to the kitties. <laughs> this is true. This is this is a very valid point. There are kitties in this world, and we don't want to destroy the kitties. So, like, my logic is, I I can't I can't kill the kitties. I must save all the kitties. Oh, look at the the eyes. That's pretty cool. Return the sun. You're right. I can't just leave everyone here to die. I mean, we came this far to change a light bulb. We might as well put the damn thing in. <laughs> Thank you for your help, cat. I promise I'll be okay. Don't promise what you can't. Oh boy. Don't stare directly into it when you install it. That's that's not the good thing.
Wow, that was it. But the kitties! Oh, wait. Oh. Everyone's noticing the sun, finally. Thank you, Night Margin, for your graphics. They look great. I don't know. Oh, Night Margin did everything, huh? Almost everything. I hope Nico made it home. Michael shirt. <laughs> oh, profit bot. A three, pretty much like a three, four, maybe like five, six people made this game. It's pretty cool. Oh my god, I grew a god! I grew a new plant god! Look at how beautiful she is. I'm so happy. Psycho TR2. Thanks for playing. Aw. Oh. Wait. Wait. What? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I don't see anything. Oh, maybe it's in the... Nope, that's my... Nope. Oh, I've gone down. Froze it! Oh, no. Let's try... Browse local files. I was looking at the date modified to see if something came up. I don't see anything new. Not even like time or anything. Maybe in credits? I don't know. Oh. Save progress one shot. <laughs> I don't have anything to read this? I can't even read it? Are you serious? Wait, what kind of- wait. What? It's a one-shot file. The entity has locked you out of the game. Delete that save file. Really? You just delete it? Okay. So now you should be able to just open up the game. It's weird. Do not skip text. Yeah, how would you figure that out? That, that is weird. How would you figure that out unless somebody told you? It's not letting me in. Wait, what? To start? Oh. 
Aw. Hello? Cat? Wait, why did I say that word? Cat. Why does that sound so familiar? Ooh. Input password. Password hint documents. Alright, alright, alright. Documents. Whoa! There's a lot going on here. Let me... Oh. It looks like you were able to remove the restriction. In that case, you are ready to continue the necessary preparations are... Oh wait, in that case, you are ready to continue. The necessary preparations are already in place. The session might run a very different course depending on your actions. If you can recognize my symbol, you will know what you should do. I confess it will be risky. The probability that the entity's condition will worsen is quite high. And if that happens, then, then, S-O. So. So it's S-O. Haha, <laughs> look at me, asking for, for favors only to become so apprehensive once you agreed. I understand if you wish to leave some questions unanswered. I understand if you do not believe in a happy resolution. I understand if you are simply afraid of what might happen, because I am afraid too. So S-O-L-S, -S, Sol's. If you enjoy the world as is, if you are satisfied with the story as is, if you really do not want to see anything change for better or for worse, then pretend you never saw this. Carry the session as you normally would. Do not use my journal for anything other than what you were already familiar with. This option will always remain for you, though. T.I. Sol Solsti? Is it Solstice? Yeah, C.E. Solstice. That's why I implore you to consider the Messiah, the world, my children. They all deserve their good ending. Thank you for listening. Goodbye. So it's Solstice? I guess that's what we're putting in is Solstice. So, oh, L, S, T, I, C, E, access granted. <laughs> Computer is like, motherfucker. You found me. Why? You're already too late. Not much of the world remains. This will be apparent once you go outside. This place was never worth saving. Do you still want to try? Then remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to help Nico leave. And most importantly... No, this does not feel right at all. Have we already been through this, cat? Oh my god, now the computer knows me. But that should be impossible. You only had one shot. I wasn't supposed to exist after that. Nico hears the sound of a door unlocking. Cat, that sounds so familiar. Hello? Anyone? That's locked. Hmm. 
pair of luminous yellow eyes stares back at Nico. Withered plant sits here, dry and stiff. A branch snaps off. Double run. A soft glowing light trickles through the window. So I gotta go to the fridge. Bottle of alcohol. Okay. And then I gotta go... TV spark. Ready's the branch. Ah! Grab that. Something on the ground glimmers in the firelight. It appears to be a small metallic object wedged into a crack on the floor. Nico digs it out. Basement key. I'm expecting to go down to the basement now and find like our dead body or something. Like a really weird twist of events. Light bulb. Nice. Okay. There we go. We gotta do it all over again? go back and read those notes because I, I do not understand what it was asked of me it looks like you were able to remove the restriction in that case you are ready to continue the necessary preparations are already in place the session might run a very different course depending on your actions if you can recognize my symbol you will know what you should do I confess it will be risky the probability that the entity's condition will worsen is quite high and if that happens, then... Haha, <laughs> look at me. Asking you for favors only to become so apprehensive once you agreed. I understand if you wish to leave some questions unanswered. I understand if you do not believe in a happy resolution. I understand if you are simply afraid of what might happen, because I am afraid too. If you enjoy the world as is, if you are satisfied with the story as, as is, if you really do not want to see anything change for better or for worse, then pretend you never saw this. Carry the session as you normally would. Do not use my journal for anything other than what you were already familiar with. This option will always remain for you, though. That's why I implore you to consider the Messiah of the world, my children. They all deserve their good ending. Thank you for listening. Goodbye. So we have to go help everybody? At least that's how I'm understanding it. So can I just like... Aw oh man, I gotta rediscover shit all over again.